Hello, welcome back to yet another video from Matt's YouTube and of course I have to link today's video to the last video that I posted which is about Vinland Saga Season 2 Episode 4. Now two philosophies came up in that and I and I did say that um potentially I'll make one large video about the entire season two or the entire season one of Vinland Saga again I can't really promise anything per se and also only four episodes have come out so that's far into the future and then later on in that pretty long video then I'll cover on majority of philosophy that is discussed in Vinland Saga but I was thinking to myself you know what just so I can have a Vinland Saga themed week I guess for fun and to make my research just, just a tiny bit less or actually a lot less if i'm being honest uh i'm going to pick apart the two philosophies which i found in vin saga starting with one well, yeah starting with um today's video which would be what is the natural order of power now in vin saga well, yeah in vin saga episode four season two they did discuss or well, storfin stated that uh the strong kill the weak and that's how it goes in this world is it because then i i remembered i, I don't know if like you're watching villain saga and then you're thinking of demons at the same time but that's just me i was thinking about ben goku's words yeah and what his mom said ben goku's mother yeah said that you are strong to protect the weak damn I think that's actually from the manga. If it is, I'm actually sorry, but I believe it was from um, rather. I should have talked about that. I should have stated that I was talking about Demon Slayer before I actually started discussing it. But that's besides the point. That will be today's topic, and I hope you enjoy. And as usual, let's get this video. I don't have to do the click anymore because I'm not loading any intro. Power over others or being belittled by others could be seen as in a physical sense, like being physically weaker than someone uh, and being prone to like physical attacks from other people because of the fact that one may be weaker than a stronger person or it could be hierarchy, hierarchical hierarchical that word um it could be based on a hierarchy whether it be uh normal citizens and then the government um it could, they could be in multiple th there's multiple aspect aspects to the word power like the and then most people may debate power and money and most people link together power and money uh, the amount of power you have equates to the amount of status. The amount of status may equate uh, quite uh, equates to the amount of money. The amount of money, obviously, um, can be seen with where one lives or the area in which one lives. But whether it be that physical strength or that economic strength, and in the same line or the same sense, social strength. Should we abuse such power and use it to belittle others? Because we're blessed or we're given or we've worked hard for this the status, the strength, whether it be the strength, physical strength, or our economic status. We've we've worked hard potentially from the bottom to get to the top, or it's been handed uh, handed to us on a silver platter. let me give you a scenario if you were to go around yeah and i mean bragging about your power is one thing then abusing and bullying people with that power bragging about it is completely different but if you were to okay yeah um unjustly used status to put someone in jail or actually this is not something many people think about when they think about power i mean most feminists yes I'm talking to probably half the people watching. Um, uh, normally think that oh, men are the one in power and we're like at, at the bottom and we, we have to rise to. Um, okay, sure. But let me give you the scenario. A man is accused of rape. The woman is using her position as a female. 
to accuse that man of rape. Yeah, I don't even think I can say the R word on the uh, like at all before I get demonetized. <laughs> um, so yes, the woman accuses the man of rape, and she's using that power. She's abusing that power to get what she wants, and she's abused that power. Let me give you an another scenario. Someone at the top, let, let's say another woman again. Um, she gives out to specific charities and watches the charity give all of the money, not 20% of the money, not 50%, not 80% of the money, all of the money to the people in need. That is using that power and status. Which one seems more natural? Because yes it's human nature to abuse power whether it be strength in a, a fight between two men or a fight between two women yeah to who, to see who can physically dominate the other person but what seems more right helping people with that power protecting those that are weak and then therefore making them strong or belittling others who are weak therefore keeping them at the bottom that was actually personally rather interesting. I, I don't know what are your thoughts. Have have I, you know, answered the question correctly? Uh, but actually, I think I just left it on a cliffhanger. Let, let me let me let me actually complete this video. Personally, wow, this this was like a damn essay. <laughs> I mean, dead serious. This video was like an, a video essay. Um, yeah, but personally, damn, I just wrote like a whole English language paper to one answer or like a religious studies twelve mark question. <laughs> Um, with one question. <laughs> um, personally, it's pretty simple. The answer is really simple. It's obvious that you help others when necessary or if necessary, um, or you know, if capable, and to uplift them. I mean, if if they if you eventually see them do better than you, uh, one's pride or arrogance may get to them. You know, oh, I, he or she is doing better than me. I helped them, and I'm not being grateful. That's a shame. But as long as you see everyone's on that equal footing, then it's all good. Personally, I don't know about you. I don't know if you want to, you know, belittle and stomp on others with your strength or something like that. But I didn't really link it too much to Vinland Saga, but the actual context and the actual idea links to Vinland Saga. I quoted Thorfinn, but I didn't actually like talk too much about the strength aspects so let's actually get into that should people kill others just because they feel like it uh, actually that's a dumb question <laughs> uh, I, I can't even say that word damn um i might have to bleep that out or something um but yeah when it comes to the strength aspect is the natural order of things that the strong dominate the weak or that the dominant should help the weak. Because if you really think about the irony of life, we start as a defenseless, helpless baby and child. And because someone is stronger than us, we, are, we grow and get nurtured by that person on a daily basis. Until we ourselves are strong enough to stand on our own two feet and make our way through this world. As we get older, we may, you know, we produce kids who again, we restart that cycle. And then we end that cycle with being defenseless old people. Do you find that ironic? Because I actually find that very ironic. The fact that we start as, as a defenseless person or a defenseless baby and then end as a defenseless old person. That's because we're weak, fail, fragile, and we need help in both scenarios. And then in, in between, we ourselves are strong, depending on the person, and nurture those who are weak. So the natural order of things, which I'm sure Thorfinn will understand later, is that the strong protect the weak and help the weak become strong. So that when the strong become weak, the stronger can protect the weak. 
yeah, that, that last part just confused everything but um i hope you enjoyed the video and it's a good thing i was able to like plop in that extra bit because i linked it to Brendan Tiger but i didn't say anything about it so that was a bit contradictory um but yeah as per usual um i just made a whole video on like a line and a half which is something that's uh, crazy but um as per usual hope you enjoyed hope you like hope you like subscribe comment and share um what are your thoughts i want to hear them in the comments please and as per usual peace